We are now joined by UFC middleweight Alessio DiCirico. Alessio, thank you very much for joining us today. Thank you, guys. We'll take our first questions from Jordan Ellis with Low Kick MMA. Your line is open. Okay. Alessio, yeah. how are you doing? Oh, good. Just one minute that is coming, my, my friend that helped me translate. Huh? Okay, perfect. Oh, okay. Um, you? I just want to ask you how, how you're going, um, how you're doing heading into this fight. Um, obviously, on the back of, of three tough losses, how are you feeling? I feel in the corner. Uh, I feel that uh, I have to win, I have no choice. And especially after, you know, you hear um, Dana White speaking about potentially cutting 60 fighters, was there a, a fear that you might be on that list? Uh, can you repeat the question, please? Sorry, okay. So um, when Dana White announced that he was potentially cutting 60 fighters, was there a fear on your side, Alessio, that you might be one of them? Yes, yes, but every UFC fighter that came also from a loss uh, can, can be cut. So it's uh, a feeling that every fighter know. And despite that, you've got a huge opportunity in front of you. Um, Joaquin Buckley, he's, he's, he's got a ton of hype behind him right now. Um, what do you make of this matchup and him as an opponent? I I I'm very um, I'm very happy for this. I am happy to to get a fighter in this period. Uh, happy to to work, and I'm here to fight the best fighter in the world. That's the reason I am UFC. Uh, I don't want to be a parasite that stay in the peripheric zone of the rankings. You know? I won't stay here, and I want to demonstrate that. I can stay here every fight, in every fight. Yeah, and at, at, at the end of 2020, we've seen Marvin Vittori go and headline an event, the first Italian to do so. Do you take inspiration from that and what he's been able to achieve? I, I was very, very happy for him because he deserved it. He's a, he's a friend of mine. And uh, yes, he inspires us and uh, he, he makes Italy on the maps, you know? You know? So, oh, yes. Okay. So thanks for answering your questions. Good luck with fight nights. Thank you. We'll go next to Gabriel Gonzalez with Cage Side Press. Your line is open. Hey, Alessio, how are you? Hi, good. You? I'm doing good. Um, this fight was announced pretty recently, less than a month ago. But how long have you known about this fight with Joaquin Buckley? No, no, I, uh, I'm on. You know, I, I don't know why, but as soon as I seen the contract, the, the, notice, the notice came out. So, uh, yeah, just a month. Uh, this fight is getting a lot of attention with the event. It's going to be the first event with the fans. Is there more excitement for you? Because you know people are tuning in a lot for Joaquin, but obviously this is a good fight also. I think that this is very, very exciting for me, uh, also because it's the first event in, uh, in 2021. And, uh, you know, uh, go, go, go there, go on the, on the MMA ring is, uh, is, is, is always something about adrenaline, you know? The best fight is the, the, the most difficult fight for me. Uh, my final question, just what are your thoughts on Joaquin's style as an opponent? He is a, he, he is a, a very well-rounded fighter, uh, very good boxing and kicker, and very good grappling. So yeah. he is a, he's a very, very, very tough fighter. Thank you, Alessio. Good luck. Thank you. We'll take our final questions from Omar Mert with Esport. Your line is open. Hello, Alessio. How are you? Hi, fine. You? Perfect. Thank you. I appreciate it. Your opponent back is a rising star. What kind or uh, what kind game plan do you have against him? Uh, I, I prefer to don't speak about strategy. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, what do you think about Buckley? Buckley is a very, very, very tough fighter. Very good boxing and. Uh, in some boxing movement, he reminds me of Mike Tyson. Uh, and he's, a, he's a very good kicker and also very, very good uh, wrestling and defense. He's a very powerful guy. So uh, I think it will, it will be absolutely the, an amazing fight. 
Okay. Uh, my last question is, we know you played American football before. Do you have any favorite in NFL, any favorite team? Ah, yeah, yes, a lot. But uh, my favorite is uh, Chicago Bears. Uh, what do you think can be champion this season? Which team? Per te chi sarà il nostro Ah, eh, I don't know. I really don't know. <laughs> okay, okay. Thank you. Good luck on Saturday, Alessio. Thank you. Thank you, guys. All right. Thank you very much, Alessio. Uh, you're all set. Thank you, guys.